Uh, last game on the board, the last of the 16 games. Philadelphia at Seattle. Was it three and a half? Now it's four. Monday night football. All of a sudden, the Philadelphia Eagles find themselves in a must-win situation. They are the number one wild card team. They win out, they'll still win the division. And look, they can they can do themselves a service this weekend if they win and the Cowboys lose against the Bills, which is what we're predicting. Um I don't really have a ton of thoughts on this game right now. I think that I do think that the Eagles defense is in trouble. I don't I don't think like they're just struggling. They seem bad. Um yeah, I mean they just played Dallas, had a bye week, then the Chiefs then Buffalo, then the 49ers, then Dallas. I mean, I get the questions about their defense. It's just, what are you going to do? There's like seven good teams in football. They played three of them or four of them in the last five weeks. Um, it's just, that's life when you have a first place schedule. So, um, yeah, on paper, compared to their last couple of games, this should be a cakewalk. Like, they're much better than the Seahawks and you have a banged up Geno Smith or Drew Locke playing. But Chad just said it, this number was five. It went down to three and a half in a lot of books. Now it's up to four. So I think even the professionals are like a little weary of backing this Eagles team on the road here, but I think it's priced right. Like I have it at four and a half. So I'm showing a little bit of value on the Eagles, but I'm not enough to make me be like, Oh, you got to take it here. And it's not even that good of a spot. I mean, back to back road games, no. um, not ideal, but, at least they get a little bit of extended rest. They get that extra day, which is nice for them. Um, and this is kind of it, right? Like they play this game and they have Giants, Arizona, Giants. Like I think the Eagles know that this really is the decider if they win their division in the one seed. Like they have to win this one. Uh, the 49ers still have to play the Ravens, which is what, you know, could trip up the 49ers and make it so they don't get the one seed. But um Bad, 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 bad spot for Seattle with a sense of the Eagles team, veteran team, they're going to be pissed off. I mean, they're going to be shit on like you wouldn't believe it all week. That was an embarrassing loss, right? Three turnovers by – they had a turnover by Hertz, turnover by A.J. Brown, a turnover by Devontae Smith. That's not very characteristic of that Eagles team. So they're not as bad as they looked. The issue here is the public knows that. They're, they're right, right behind yep. the Ravens as the most publicly bet team right now this week. So – um, another one, I don't know if it's going to make me and Chad's five, but I, I do show value right now in this Eagles team of four.